so multiplication if you have one term in front and two terms in the bracket so for example right so how we do this is we have to distribute this 2a into the bracket so we have to multiply it into the bracket like that so we're first going to take the 2a and multiply it by the 4b so we start with the numbers and we say 2 times 4 is 8 and then the letters a times b is just ab the sign is a plus times a plus so we have a plus in the middle and then we have 2 times this imaginary one over here which gives us 2 and a times c is ac okay did you all get that so that's how you do it if you have one term in front and two in the bracket next we're going to look at if you have two brackets each with two terms in it so so most of you learned the foil method for this one so foil stands for first outer inner and last right so the way we do this is we multiply the two first terms together so that's 2x times 2x so 2 times 2 is 4 x times x is x squared next we do the outer terms and the outer terms are 2x and y negative y so positive times a negative is a negative 2 times 1 is 1 and x times y is x1. Then we do the inner terms which is y and 2x. So that is negative times a positive which is negative. 2 times 1 is 2 and x times y is xy. And then the last terms are y and y. This negative multiplied by this negative gives a positive. And then y times y is y squared. So now we look for like terms. Our like terms here are xy and xy. So our four x squared remains the same. We say negative two minus two, which is minus four, and xy is the like term, and then our y squared. Okay. Lastly, we're going to do the binomial squared, which is sorry a bracket with two terms in it to the power of two this essentially equates to a minus two times a minus two and if we do it this way we can use foil again and we'll say a times a is a squared minus two times a is minus two a this minus two times that a will give you a squared this will give a plus four minus two a right so it's the same thing as earlier we'll have a, a squared that remains the same a minus 2 minus 2 which is minus 4 a plus 4 right that's the one way of doing it the other way we can do it is some of you learned the um sts method so that stands for square double square so we first take the first term and we square it and we get a squared next we take these two terms and multiply it together which is minus 2 a and then we double it to get minus 4a and then we square the last term which is plus 4 so if you aren't comfortable with sts yet you can use the longer foil method but if you do know sts it's quicker in your exams and you can just do it that way